my name is Gracia and I'm Maria and this is dyes 101 so today we're going to be talking about the two different kinds of dyes that we use in making pressure sensitive labels and not to get confused with dye DYE which stains we are talking about dye DIE which is used to cut labels correct so what is the difference well besides the visual look of both of these dyes this is obviously engraved. It's good for really long runs. It's very durable and it can be resharpened if it ever becomes dull. The magnetic dies don't have that advantage. They're used for something more of a quick run. They are cost effective and they are easily disposable. So Gracia, how do these work? Well, both of these dies are analogous to cookie cutters. The same way you grab a cookie cutter and you put it on your dough and you get a cute little cookie cutout, <laughs> what you do is the same kind of thing. We put our dies on our machine, which has a magnetic cylinder on top, which is what the die is on right now, and then an anvil right at the bottom. And then from there, the material is weaved through right down the middle and as the machine starts rolling and turning, the magnetic die starts to create that cutout. And from that cutout, there's um, excess material that sits there that we don't need and we need to get rid of. And this is what Maria is pulling now. And that is what we call our matrix. So do our customers always have to purchase dies? No. We have a ton of different sizes. We also provide 100% custom labels. So if your job is 100% custom, just like this one was, we do advise that you get a custom cut. You don't always need it. Sizes like rectangles and circles will not be required. We have plenty to choose from, but it is recommended if it is 100% custom. We created this video in hopes that it creates an easier visual representation of what it really takes to make these custom labels. Yes, don't hesitate to contact us with questions and don't forget to follow us on Instagram at Las Vegas Labels.